Bingley Music Live with DJ Fresh on the sofa backstage. How are you? Yeah, yeah, really good. How you doing? Haven't seen you for a while. You did see me about two weeks ago, though, to be fair. Fresh and I sat and had a massive, big, like, chat, put the world to rights well and truly. We were filming a room full of ice, which was quite cold. I remember you coming out looking absolutely freezing and then telling an amazing story about Siberia. Yeah, well, it just brought back the memory so vividly, being in a freezing cold room full of ice, that I just had to, you know, indulge everyone with the full story. Do you prefer the sun, do you reckon? The sun? Um, yeah, yeah, definitely. So today, you're at Bingley Live, you've got fresh live here. What can we expect? Um, well, we're just getting ready to... This is one of our last shows of, like, this sort of phase of fresh live. So going into our next tour in November... Tickets on sale now at gigsandtours.com. We will be updating everything, adding some uh, even more like new album tracks and stuff like that. So this is kind of really, I think the, the great thing about something like this is this is when we're at our most honed at doing what we're doing at the moment, playing the tracks that we've been playing. So we feel really comfortable now and we're just really enjoying playing, you know, and then we're going to go back into a really experimental, like feeling really nervous on stage, learning how to play everything again phase. Now, for you guys that are watching, Fresh just signed deals across the globe, which are pretty monumental. How's that feeling for you now? Yeah, really good, really good. I've never really been that um, that focused on America. You know, a lot of artists have this dream about going to America and smashing America, and obviously that would be amazing, but I just really want to just be good at what I do over here. And if there's a way of things working out in America without me needing to lose my sort of focus on the UK then that's great but my main sort of goal really is just to keep the people that are into what I'm doing from my home into it do you know what I mean? How's that going to be when you go to America because obviously electronic music over there and bass music is really kicking off are you going to have to change what you're doing or do you think they're going to accept it as it is right now? I don't know but I'm definitely not going to be changing it so they're either going to have to accept it or not accept it. <laughs> I've been working with a couple of American artists and just naturally I've been sort of been in, I've always been a sort of like I was a rock kid when I was younger so there's always been an influence of that in my music and some of the new stuff there are a few guitars in it and I'm not going to go on a rock route per se but there there is an element of what I'm doing at the moment that does encompass that that might might be received well in the states or, but if it's not then it's not do you know what I mean so with regards to festivals what's been your favorite one so far probably V festival uh, we did like six gigs in two days we got asked to cover Nicki Minaj's show uh, second from headline on the second stage we played to about um, 40,000 people on the second day it's like absolutely packed um, that was just amazing, you know, and we only started the band six months ago so to, to, to sort of like come from playing and I remember the first gig was like literally 400 people and to go from that in six months to doing second from headline at V is just like such an amazing feeling. So what's next for you from here? Because obviously you've just signed this massive deal, you're going to be all over the place. Like, what's next for you? A lot of work, a lot of work. I mean, it's been, the thing is like DJing and doing a live show, so much work because I could quite happily spend all my time just working on the live show or just working on my DJ set, producing for other people, making my own tracks. It's just like a lot of work, but as, uh, as Eminem said, you get one shot, do you know what I mean? So I'm just trying to make it count, just trying to do the most that I can, trying to do the best music that I can and see what happens. It's awesome to have you here. Thank you so much. This is DJ Fresh at Bingley Music Live.